y'all I'm having I'm having like the hardest time with my lighting sometimes you should just leave well enough alone I have too many lights I should have just left it with two so this is a very very small drugstore haul last night me and my addiction I was like you know what I just want to go look at some makeup let's go let's go see what's up there so I went to Walgreens which they didn't really have anything new if you want to be honest but um let's just see what's in my little knapsack so I grabbed something from wet and wild and I grabbed a lot of stuff from wet and wild and I grabbed a little holly lashes or shutter shock lashes they were 99 cents I don't have too much good luck when it comes to getting lashes from like the drugstore or from um like the dollar store or something for me i like for me they always tear up or something so yeah y'all gotcha. gotta excuse my hair i'm looking a hot hot mess um i did flat iron my hair this is all my hair at the top and i didn't flat iron it or do anything to it but i am gonna put some flexi rods in it but let's be on the point okay the wet and wild i grabbed was this wet and wild foundation brush i just wanted to try it out see what it was about since i haven't seen so many people hauling their brushes i was like let me try them i haven't used a foundation brush like this in uh who knows when but being as my skin is so dry i think it might help you know like pulling down because i have that's how i have to put my foundation on i have to go in downward motions i can't really do circular motions because of my tricep with this wet and wild fergie uh vicious varnish and um ball in vienna is what it's called and it's just if you're new to my channel sorry if i talk to you guys like you know me anyways if you don't know me i'm leia and welcome to my channel and i hope you stick around but um last night it was a tornado warning not even just a warning like a tornado touchdown like around the corner for me and i was so scared that like me and my daughters i re-ran into the bathroom was huddled in there and i called my husband and he was on his golf cart and i'm like you could, you need to come here. I'm scared. So, yeah. So, I had a rough night last night. That's why I didn't do anything to myself. But this is what it looks like. I probably have an up-close watch. But it's just a pink lip gloss. Now, I heard <clears throat> that people don't like these because they're sticky. I've never had one of the Fergie High Shine lip glosses from Wet n Wild still. On this Wet n Wild thing. And I wanted to try their Mega Slicks Balm Stain. It's like a big, fat, chubby stick. And... I just wanted to see this one is in a stiff pink a stiff pink all right nothing wrong with that I love me a stiff pink too so yeah it looks like that doesn't smell like anything and it's just a bomb so it's gonna have that real greasy look to it but it's still a nice pink it's from wet and wild they had a natural blend lip shimmer natural blend lip shimmer <clears throat> and um I don't know what it is never seen a swatch never heard anyone talk about it so i grabbed it of course naturally and this one is in sugar so so this is basically smell like ugh smells like menthol how do you get this out of here i don't even know how to get this out what is this what is this y'all uh, how do you get it out what is it lip shimmer i can't even get it out to give you guys a swatch of it i don't know y'all i'm sorry i don't know what this is i don't know what this is it stinks and i it won't come out the tube it doesn't roll up i don't know i think from wet n wild i got was this wet n wild cover all primer base it's right there and i seen you guys haul it and um you know what's funny to me y'all but wet and wild to be like so wet and wild it's funny to see them have something like black and white because to me it's like boring colors but i guess it's because it's a primer so and this is more of a lotion primer which i like because i used to use the black radiance lotion primer and it, it, it goes good with my skin because the silicone base tends to turn my foundations ashy a little bit so that's nice it's a nice consistency kind of Kind of out from wet and wild i grabbed the rimmel scandal eyes this is a black gel liner i have been wanting to try gel liner to do my wings 
I have one of these, but I actually bought it in brown. And um, so I wanted to get it in black in the right color and see how I like it. So yeah, I grabbed the last two items I grabbed was the Ready Set Gorgeous from CoverGirl. I grabbed it in 315, 315 Tawny. Now they had a sale on these, it was buy one get one half off. So I actually had 315 and 320 and I was gonna mix them. But now that I look at 315, Tawny is my color. I wear Tawny and everything. So I'm like, why was I gonna get the other one? I don't know. I'm so used to having, having to mix two foundations. I, had it in my basket so when I rolled back by I was like okay that's silly so I went on ahead and grabbed the covergirl ready set go concealer so that I can conceal and I have this one in medium deep and I almost picked it up in the deepest shade but the deepest shade was the same color as the tawny so I was like okay that's silly <laughs> so I went for the medium deep it's what which is what I wear in concealers all the time What's up, y'all? I am here today to tell you about some hair. 